The Mustard Seed Media video podcast is sponsored and created by Mustard Seed Media Inc., creating and developing media and web for tomorrow's Christian ministries. On the web at mustardseedmedia.com. Okay, so let's open up Drupal.org and let's do a little CMS magic. Okay, so let's start with this Photoshop document here and let's turn this thing into a website. Let's get right down to it and edit some CSS, shall we? Welcome to the Mustard Seed Media Video Podcast. My name is Bob, and this is the podcast for Drupal web designers. A few weeks ago, we did a podcast about podcasting with Drupal 6, where we profiled the file field podcast module and basically how to podcast without using audio module uh, with a pure CCK and views workflow. What happened between then and now is that the views API changed, which uh, basically broke a whole lot of views modules. So we had to rewrite file field podcast. So this podcast is going to be uh, hopefully it'll stick around. Hopefully views won't change again. And uh, this will be how to use file field podcast module to podcast in Drupal 6 with just CCK views and file field. And that's it. So we're going to dive right in today and I'm going to show you basically how to set up file field podcast module in order to spit out a podcast feed uh, and, uh, from views, which is very simple to do. Uh, let's go over some overview stuff first of how I sort of set generally set stuff up and then I'll just show you how to build the view. Uh, so, first thing we're going to look at is File Field Podcaster homepage. Uh, you'll notice that there's still some notes here that basically say, because Views is still under a release candidate uh, stage at this point, don't consider File Field Podcast module a final a, uh, version, uh, which is what we ran into last time. If you run into any problems, uh, make sure you note as I go through here which versions of all the modules I'm using. So if you go and you're using later versions and something doesn't work as I show here, uh, make sure you jump over to the issue queue, uh, which you can get at uh, just by viewing open issues on this page right here. And uh, check to see if there's any other people having the problem. It may be another change that we have to deal with. Uh, so anyway, you just download FileFill Podcast module, and uh, I'm going to show you what other modules you need now. So here's the versions and the modules that I have installed to be able to do this. Uh, first is CCK. Notice we're on RC10 right now. Uh, it also requires file field, which I have a later version of file field. Uh, file field was another module that broke with the change in views, so make sure you have a later version. I'm using alpha 5 here. Uh, you need file field meta enabled. We're also using get ID 3 module. Now, uh, something that we're going to develop later in the file field podcast kind of workflow here is the ability to change ID 3 tags right in the Drupal interface. Right now, you cannot do that. Uh, we, don't, we haven't developed a module to do that yet. So basically what you need to do is make sure you enter all your ID3 tags, your episode image, all that stuff uh, into the ID th or into the MP3 file uh, or MP4 file, whatever you're using, before upload. Uh, and then the get ID3 module will actually go ahead and recognize those and use those uh, for your feed. Uh, and then we're using SWF tools. This really doesn't have anything to do with the feed itself. We're using this to display the player, uh, the, the actual player, so people can listen on the site. And you notice we're using one pixel out player. Um, and that is a player you actually have to download separately. Uh, but you can look at uh, SWF Tools uh, module for all that information. Uh, and then we're using Views. Notice we're using RC5. Uh, if there's a later version that you're using and something breaks, uh, make sure to check the issue queue again using the Views UI, obviously. And then we're using point, or, uh, 0 0.7 of File Field Podcast. Once Views goes uh, out of release candidate stage and is a formal release, uh, we will release File Field Podcast uh, version 1, 6.x-1. Uh, uh, so that's all the modules that I'm using. Let's take a look at how we have our podcast node set up. This is just a CCK node type, no big deal. Uh, it's not a special node type of any kind. Just create it with CCK. All we did was we tacked on a file field, uh, and this is where we're going to upload our audio file. Uh, so if we go ahead and we look at an episode, uh, this is basically what we have. Uh, I'll show the edit screen just so you can see. And basically, it's just title body, as you would in any other uh, node. And then we just have a file field showing our, or where we can upload our audio file. Uh, now, the other thing I want to show you is just how this is themed. You'll notice we do have a player here. That player actually has to be inserted uh, using some special uh, code from SWF Tools. Uh, so we've themed our uh, node-podcast to include our audio player. Uh, this notation or this syntax is available on the SWF Tools homepage. Uh, so you can find that there, and it's real easy. Basically, all you're doing is <clears throat> telling SWF Tools where your file is located once it's uploaded. 
So all of that being said, we've got our podcast episode here, and uh, we're using File Field to attach our uh, audio file. Let's go ahead and build our podcast view using File Field Podcast. We're going to go into Views, and we're going to add a new view. I'm just going to call this View Podcast. And all I'm going to do is make a feed from this view. I'm not actually going to do any uh, node display or anything like that. Oops, let's try again. Okay, so once we've uh, created this, uh, we're going to set up our filters first, just as our defaults. And obviously, we want to filter a couple of things. Uh, these aren't really don't really have to do with the uh, the feed itself. This is just to filter out which nodes you want to appear in the feed. So we're going to make it make sure that our episodes are published, and we only want to show nodes that are podcasts. Uh, and then we're also going to put our nodes in reverse chronological order. So we're going to choose post date descending. Uh, to make sure they show up in the order that we add them. Uh, we're going to go ahead and change how many items display. This is going to be how many items are in your feed. Let's say 25. Uh, and then we're going to go ahead and we're going to make our feed. Now, something different from the old version of File Field Podcast is now you just select feed and you add that display. And now there's a couple of settings you have to change right away. The first thing is the style. I'm going to click that and you'll see that a new style includes podcast feed. This makes sure that our, uh, our feed is uh, styled so it includes our audio file and any uh, get ID3 information or anything else that we're doing. So we're going to update that and then we have to also choose a row style uh, and we need to choose podcast episode as that row style. Uh, this is going to be how the, the feed is actually formatted. And A new option you'll see here that's real nice is we can format our feed however we want. Uh, full text, title teaser, title only, or use default RSS settings. Um, and usually we just want to use the default. Uh, something I skipped over real quick that I should note is if we go back to a style podcast feed and uh, we can actually enter the name of our feed here. So whatever we want our feed to be called, we'll just, uh, we can just add that in there. Uh, then the uh, other thing that it needs is the path. This is where your feed's going to be located. We'll just put it at podcast feed one. Uh, and then the final thing that is required by one of these feeds is to actually add your audio file as a field. So we're going to add that audio file. I don't want any labels. Oh, you can just leave the format as generic file. Now, do not add anything else to these uh, fields because what you're actually outputting is really more like a teaser than it is uh, like a field uh, set, like if you think of how views normally works. And all you're doing with this fields is you're adding this audio file in as an enclosure. So don't add anything else here. Do all of your feed styling uh, using Contemplate module or something else that you would normally use to style a feed. So once all that's done, let's save it. And now we're just going to view our feed at the URL we added. And there we have our feed. You can see that it inserted the title of the feed uh, that we wanted and that we added. And then we have our episode and we have our audio file as an attachment. So that's it uh, for using File Field Podcast module. If you have any questions, go ahead and post uh, either issues in the File Field Podcast issue queue or go ahead and post some notes in this episode uh, listing over at mustardseedmedia.com slash podcast. Uh, and don't forget to check out my other audio podcast over at geeksandgod.com. Uh, and that's it. Until next week, have a great week. <laughs>